We just have two muscles in our gluteal group. There actually are three. Gluteus minimus is also a gluteal muscle with the name gluteus in it, but it's not on our required list of things to do. We've got plenty. So gluteus maximus is the muscle primarily responsible for our lovely buttocks. And no one is exactly sure, like, why? Why do we have big butts? Really, our butts are bigger than any other critter's butts, which is a really interesting, like, why? Why do we have these big butts, even when we think we don't have big butts? But we do have big butts for critters mostly because of the gluteus maximus. Now, there was some speculation that having, well, perhaps I will not speculate. Let's just figure out what these muscles are and where they attach and what they do. Let's go look at a picture first. If you take a look at gluteus maximus, it's the most superficial muscle. It's very large. It attaches to the posterior aspect of the iliac spine. And it also attaches down to the IT band. Here's tensor fascia latte, and this is the IT band. And this is where um, old boy gluteus maximus attaches. Now, if we um, peel off gluteus maximus, peel it away, you can see gluteus medius, which is also attached to the iliac spine or the iliac crest. Let's see, yeah, the iliac crest. That's where the gluteus maximus is attached also. I think I said glute, whatever I said. I think I said iliac spine, but I meant crest. Rewind, rewind, crest. And then gluteus medius I think is the only one that we're learning right now that also attaches to the greater trochanter. So it's going to come across to the femur and attach to the greater trochanter. Because of where it attaches to the greater trochanter, it actually does some medial rotation. Gluteus maximus does lateral rotation. So let's go um, compile this knowledge. Gluteus maximus, first attachment is iliac crest. Both of them attach to the iliac crest. Gluteus maximus, it, yeah, we'll just go with that. And then um, gluteus maximus it also attaches to the IT band. And gluteus medius attaches to the greater trochanter. That says greater trochanter. And then gluteus maximus, its major action is to extend thigh. Remember, extending the thigh means taking it from a folded position back toward standard anatomical position. And it also does some lateral rotation. Gluteus medius does medial rotation and abduction. And that has to do with where it attaches. Because it attaches to the place that it attaches on the greater trochanter, it does this medial rotation thing. I mean the abduction piece. Okay, let's take a look at the hamstrings group. We're in the back. We just did our buns. Now we're going to do hamstrings, which are posterior thigh muscles.